Welcome to the July 14th, 2022 Board of Education meeting, uh, meeting for the Fairfield City School District. Mrs. Lane, will you call the roll, please? Mr. Begley? Here. Ms. Birding? Here. Mr. Clark? Mrs. Gundrum? Yeah, here. Mrs. Shorter? Here. Uh, Pledge of Allegiance, please stand with me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Mr. Smith, I apologize for missing the last board meeting. Did we have our friends here at the diocese last meeting as well? No, this is oh, the first meeting. This is the beginning of a new era. This it is. is. Yeah. It is. Yes. Well, then <laughs> let me be the first to welcome uh, Assistant Superintendent Rice to the to the podium, as well as Ms. Hauer, our Director of Human Resources. Thank you. Sure. Thank you. Uh, first order of business is communication. Uh, there is no one on the sign-up list, so we will move right along. All right. Thank you, Mr. Begley. At this time, I'd like to ask Mrs. Howard to cover the items listed under personnel, professional, and personnel support. Thank you, Mr. Smith. Mr. Begley and members of the board, I have several items for your consideration this evening. Under personnel professional, number one, resignations, letters A through J. And under number two, employment, letters A through U. You can see our administrative staff and HR department have been very busy working to fill all of our positions and make sure we got the right people in the right places. I'd like to take just a moment to bring special attention to item letter K under employment there. I am very excited to recommend to you Mr. Eric Stevenson as the assistant principal at Crossroads Middle School. Eric joins us this evening. Mr. Stevenson. Um, he joins us professionally from Hamilton City Schools where he served as a social studies teacher at their freshman school since August of 2016. And during his tenure there, he had created and implemented a new course that was targeted to meet the needs of high-risk students. If you take time to speak with him about that course, it becomes quite evident how passionate he is about making sure that all of our kids succeed. So we're very excited about that. Um, not only does he join us with a very strong understanding of what good instruction looks like, it was very evident when interviewing him that he is all about building positive relationships with our students, with their families, with our staff, and with our community. Um, and that held true as we did reference checks as they said that building relationships is at the heart of who he is and what he does. So we are very fortunate and I am very excited to recommend him to you this evening. Um, and that concludes all of my items that I have for consideration for you under personnel professional. Great. Thank you, Ms. Sauer. Does that take us through motion. all the, yeah, okay, all right. Uh, do I have a motion to accept the recommendations? So moved. Second. Uh, Ms. Birding and, and uh, Mrs. Shorter. Please call the roll. Ms. Birding? Yes. Mrs. Shorter? Yes. Mrs. Gundrum? Yes. Mr. Begley? Yes. All right. Um, members of the board, I have several items for your consideration this evening under personnel support. Number one, resignations, letters A through D, and number two, employment letters A through D. That concludes all the items I have for your consideration under personnel support. Thank you. Do I have a motion to accept these recommendations? So moved. Second. Uh, Mrs. Gundrum and uh, you can uh, do Mrs. It. Short. <laughs> Mrs. Lang, please call the roll. Mrs. Gundrum? Yes. Mrs. Shorter? Yes. Ms. Birding? Yes. Mr. Beckley? Yes. 